Eugene? Eugene! Oh dear, he's run off with the crown and forgotten you. No, he wouldn't. Who are you? Forget Flynn Rider. You know where you belong, and it's not with him. Now. So I followed you, and I saw them attack you, and... Oh, my. Let's go. Let's go before they come, too. Isn't that Rapunzel? Wait! Rapunzel! Oh. Show some decorum. You again! Marluxia! The girl has found her dear mother. You should let them be. And why is that? Because Rapunzel is far too important. Atop her tower, she must remain out of sight and live out her days with Mother Gothel. And never see anyone else? But that's like locking her in some prison. That is exactly what it's like. Rapunzel's hair holds the powerful magic of healing. And yes, Mother Gothel wants it for herself, as do others. And if Mother Gothel's actions will protect Rapunzel, preserve her, then she is doing the organization a favor. What favor? Let's say she's keeping Rapunzel on the shelf for us. An extra pawn in case you fail to find the remaining Guardians of Light. And we have occasion to call on other Hearts of Light instead. A new seven hearts to fill out the ranks. New seven hearts? Yes. Seven who inherited the princess's light after their role was fulfilled. So you don't care about her? You guys just want Rapunzel for your own purposes. Well, you're done here. Hmm. I just knew you would go and make a scene. Very well. Then it's lights out for you. were such a sound sleeper.
I am the lost princess. Oh, please speak up, Rapunzel. You know how I hate the mumbling. I am the lost princess, aren't I? Did I mumble, mother? Or should I even call you that? Oh, Rapunzel. Do you even hear yourself? Why would you ask such a ridiculous question? <laughs> uh, it was you! It was all you! Everything I did was to protect you. Uh, Rapunzel! I've spent my entire life hiding from people who would use me for my power. Rapunzel! When I should have been hiding from you! Where will you go? He won't be there for you. What did you do to him? That criminal's to be hanged for his crimes. No. No, no, it's all right. Listen to me. All of this is as it should be. No. <gasps> no! You were wrong about the world. And you were wrong about me. And I will never let you use my hair again! <laughs> You want me to be the bad guy? Fine. Now I'm the bad guy. Is Sora okay? We don't know. We keep calling his name and shaking him, but he won't open his eyes. Sora! Wake up! Hmm. Unresponsive sidekick. Wait a minute. I know how to fix this. Max! Give him a wash. <laughs> That did the trick. Nice work, Max. Huh? How did I end up? Oh no! Flynn! Rapunzel's being held prisoner! That's right. In her mother's tower. This calls for a rescue. Are you with me? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go, Max. Whoa, 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 Max! We'll take it from here, Flynn. Go help Rapunzel. Thanks! Come on! Alright, so after that extended cutscene, um, it's finally. Enough already! Get out of our way! Come on. Well, I think he's going to Potentially we find more nobodies than partners. Oh, excuse me. By the way, I'm not sure if I just maybe um, a continuation of part two, well, another part, the second part of um, the Kino and Kino, or it might be a third part. But the third part um, should not be that much left for this world. Um, but who knows at this point. All I know is we're supposed to be heading to the Puzzle Tower, I believe. 
So I actually will transition to when I, um, possibly get there if you guys want, or if I can keep going. I'll probably keep going and just possibly talk, but if I don't find anything really worthwhile, I'll just transition to when I get to the, um, tower. So let's see what happens. Get the drill punch and they're gone. That's just rude. <laughs> ah, never mind. I can take it on these ladies. Come on, ladies. Let's have a throwdown or a hoedown. Whatever <laughs> you prefer. <laughs> Um, okay, since I have a lot of questions I've been trying to ask in some of these videos, I've probably forgotten a lot on some of these videos, but I want to try to, at least with Kingdom Hearts, try to keep it as close to Disney or maybe in Final Fantasy, really, as possible. Is it just me, or are the heartless multiplying? That can't be good. Hurry! But, let's try to come up with a Disney question for you guys. And see what, um, there is a response in my team. Oh, here's one. Um, have you guys ever been to Disneyland or World? And if so, what was your experience like? Um, I've only personally ever been to Disney World, I think it is, at the one in Orlando, Florida. Twice, technically. The first time was uh, about three years ago. Yeah, three years ago. Um, sounds right. Because me and my sister have gone on, like to go on vacation every year, and we have the uh, a couple years ago, well, three years ago, we went with our parents to have some family vacation. And we wanted to, uh, oh yeah, we wanted to visit Magic Kingdom, this is a Disney castle, and it seemed like it's a uh, good choice for it everywhere else. And we actually had a pretty good time, actually. Um, But there wasn't really, oddly enough, that much, at least not. This is, well, there's a great, great amusement park. It's just not really for adults so much as for little kids. I mean, some rides adults enjoy, but it's more meant for little kids. 
overall over anything else. But it's still not overall bad. It's just really amazing views to see. But the second time I've ever gone to Disney World was last year when they, it was like months, like at least six months or eight, six to eight months at, at the time after a almost a year maybe I don't know when they opened up the Avatar theme park or Avatar um, attraction at Animal Kingdom and I love James Cameron's Avatar a lot and I've had a I had to go and see it this time around. And there's only two rides, but it's really... If it weren't for the fact that knowing that it was um, just a park, it was really well replicated from the movie. At least I can safely say that. But there's only two rides for the Avatar. The... I know the one, uh, there's a one that's a flight simulation and there's another one that's like, or you're on the Navi River, or the river of Pandora or something like that. And that was the only one me and my sister were able to ride, because before the park even opened at Animal Kingdom, it was easily, um, it was over three hours waiting time already. And we just couldn't do it. I'll tell you about the um some of the one of the souvenirs I got there in a few. Uh, Rapunzel, I thought I'd never see you again. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> So like I was say So like I was saying, basically there was a um in one of the shops at the Pando the World of Pandora where for I think it was eighty dollars, I think. Um Lim might have already made it to the tower. They do they do a 3D scan of your face and you basically get to design your own doll as if you were an uh, avatar one of the Navi people from Avatar. It's actually a really cool process because like I said they do a scan of your face. I'm motioning my hands in front of my face as if I'm looking at the camera for some reason. Um, but if you're wearing glasses like me you couldn't wear them because they need to um, color your eye color and all that. And they try to get your facial feature as close to detail to the doll. And mine was a little off, but still pretty cool to have done. Like I said, the whole process and getting the doll, it's like $80. And it's, it was worth it. <laughs> Although a good chunk of the time when they're scanning your face, you're staring into a bright light. Which sucks. <laughs> but it was worth it. Alright, anyway, so let's keep going. Save him. I will go with you. Uh, no, no, Rapunzel. Uh, uh, I'll never uh, run. I'll never try to escape. Just let me heal him, and you and I will be together forever, just like you want. Everything will be the way it was. I promise. Just like you want. Just. Let me heal him. Uh, 
In case you get any ideas about following us. You... Eugene! Oh, I'm so sorry. Everything is gonna be okay, though. No, Rapunzel. I promise. You have to trust me. No. I can't let you do this. And I can't let you die. But if you do this... But if you do this, then you will die. Hey, it's gonna be alright. Rapunzel... Wait... Eugene, what? No! Oh no! No! What have you done? What have you done? Oh. Fall into darkness. We can't allow her near our pure light now. Her presence would only cast a pall over it. Just here's the sneeze. They're in the middle of combat, dude. <laughs> Come on, quit running from us, mother gothel. Or at least her heart was. Like 
Huh. I might try to turn. I'll probably transition when I get close to finishing this dude. Or I take her off. Please, just a minute, guys. Rapunzel. What? Uh, Rapunzel. You were my new dream. And you were mine. Thank you. 
heal what has been hurt Change the fate's design Save what has been lost Bring back what once was mine What once was mine Did I ever tell you, I've got a thing for brunettes? Oh, Eugene! Wow, Rapunzel, you're finally gonna get to see your real home! I know! I mean, I can't believe it! I can finally be with my real family! I couldn't have done it without your help. You're welcome! <laughs> well, from where I'm standing, the kingdom couldn't ask for a better princess. And I couldn't have asked for better sidekicks! Thanks. Yes, thank you so much. Mm-hmm. Now, Flynn, you and Maximus play nice. Huh? Okay. Hmm. Oh. You're gonna be great. Huh? huh? We haven't seen the guy controlling the monsters in a while, so that's one less worry. But there's still a chance that he might be around here somewhere. Well, if he comes back and tries to bother Rapunzel again, then Flynn will keep her safe. And we three won't be far behind. Come on! When Pat hooks the tough one, it's the last me. True. But nevertheless, I won't let her out of my sight. Oh, Eugene. Eugene? Oh, haha. <laughs> That's my real name. Eugene Fitzherbert. That's right. I never told you guys. That's different. Well, I think it's a great name. Me too. Nice to re-meet you, Eugene. Hey, I thought I was the only one you were going to tell? Don't worry. I've saved plenty of Fitzherberty secrets just for you. Really? Hey, what are you two lovebirds talking about? Nothing! <laughs> Nothing. Oh, you can tell us. Yeah, it's not nice to keep secrets. This one is none of your business. <laughs> Maximus, get him! Huh? <laughs> uh, you have got to be kidding me! Ooh, ever after. A keyblade with an emphasis on magic, form changes, miracle staff. Oh, no, mirage staff, sorry. I will show you guys what that looks like in a minute. Another world where we got doodly squat. Hmm. You sure this box thingy's even real? Yes. Yeah, and just how do you know that? It is etched. It's what? 
Come with me. Where to? Those bozos ain't gonna help us. Sora sure not looking for the box. Who said anything about following them? No. What? We're too late? Yes. Evan would know all about the replicas from his time as Vexen in the organization. He was re-completed like the rest of us, but he didn't regain consciousness. After Lee left, he must have woken and taken his leave. Alias here and Dylan went out and turned the whole town upside down to try and find him. But no Evan. That's not good. What about his research? Unfortunately, his work on the replicas was incomplete. There may still be documents around, but all of them from well before he made any significant progress. Do you have any idea where he might go? There's no place that he could go now that he's human. He has no means of leaving this world. The Dark Corridors! are beyond his faculties and mine now. Oh, but not everyone's. What if Evan was taken? Of course! The organization could also use the replicas. To fill out their ranks. We'd better go tell Master Yen Sid, and Sora, and the others too. Humanity is a precious gift, and yet you desire to return to the organization? Oh yes, of course. One eradication at Axel's hands was enough to learn where not to place my trust. He gave you a second lease on life. He ripped me away from the one thing I care about. I don't require humanity. Give me my research. I must see it to fruition, no matter the cost. The replicas. Yes. <laughs> Soon they will replace, not just replicate. Given a heart, they can become just as real as any human. What excellent tidings. I would hate to think we invited you back into our ranks, only for you to fail to deliver our final vessel, Vexen. <laughs> hey, a new zone! You guys should check it out! All right, now the switch. Okay. Um, I'm actually gonna end the video here. Um, I, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Make sure you hit like and subscribe if you have not already. And I will be back with another video hopefully soon. See you guys later.